Okay, so I just want to show you an antenna I built. Like most antennas I build, it is portable and made out of stuff I already had, so I didn't have to buy anything. The best features about this antenna are, since it's made out of telescopic whips, it can collapse down and be much smaller than it needs to be to be resonant on the handbands. Also, it's extremely durable. The only part of it that is not very, very um, heavily dutily built is the plexiglass coming out to hold the chassis mount. Um, it's a little bit long. I have had to replace it before due to cracking, and you can see it's starting to get a little bit of wear here, but it still works very well. And you can pull these in and out to make it resonant on different bands. I just used the double gang knockout box to fasten the antenna to because due to the different size holes and the different positioning of holes, I can fasten this any number of ways facing any direction. So it's very versatile and I can tune it extremely easily just by pulling these uh, elements in or out and adjusting the length. Um, I can use it on the digital portion of 1.25 meters, but it just doesn't collapse down quite enough for the voice portion. I've been able to tune it for 2 and 6 meters as well, and if I really messed with it, I might be able to get it down somewhere in the FM portion of 10 meters, but I haven't really tried. So I'll hook it up to the analyzer and show you what the SWR looks like. Okay, so I've pulled it out to my... We have 1.1 to 1 on the standard length that I use, and you can't really tell, but that's at 146 megahertz. I will go down to 144. Okay, now we're at 1.13, and we will go up to 148, where we'll see a slight increase to 1.2 to 1. Now, if what they say is true, that the lower you are, if you're touching the ground, say your antenna, uh, you're going to have some ground effect increasing your SWR, then I have a little bonus because my ham shack is underground so once I get this up in the air it will probably improve a little bit as well so I'm running it into this mess this is some old CB coax I have and super old but it works good enough to tune this antenna and I've been able to get this to work on six meters as well so that's the simple antenna I built I've had this built for a while I've used it portable many times um, and it's my priority antenna for emergency communications so I just wanted to show you that 73 so we'll catch you next time